question is that what are the different state of equilibrium is a structure and add end. Okay. First is that our stable equilibrium. Stable equilibrium that means if the structure is subjected to deformation, in that case, if we remove the load, the structure will attain the original position. For example, we have a beam, simply supported beam. Okay, and we apply some sort of load here. And due to the load, the structure is subjected to bending behavior. Okay. And if you remove the load, if you remove this load, okay, in that case, the structure will try to will attain the original position. Okay, if the structure it attain the original position once you remove the load, then in that case, the equilibrium conditions we used to call that was stable equilibrium. Okay, so basically here under the load structure is deformed, but again structure is in the stable conditions. Such in case the load structure is not failing, and once you remove the load structure is or attaining the original position that is called stable equilibrium stable equilibrium can be visualized like this you have a u shape like this and you have a one ball you have a one ball here and once you remove that uh, release that ball it will go these directions again we'll try to come this direction okay and like that basically structure that like that the ball will be okay that Basically, equilibrium conditions we used to call our stable equilibrium. Okay. Now, second is that unstable equilibrium. What is the unstable equilibrium? If the structure is subject to the bending and is not able to come to the original position, okay, it is attaining some other position, not the original position. Okay. In that case, the equilibrium we are saying is the unstable equilibrium. Okay. In that case, the structure is subject to large deformations. Okay, that type of deformations we used to call that unstable equilibrium. Okay, the structure is not stable now, it's become unstable. Okay, for example, a buckling problem. So, if you apply the load in this direction, okay, buckling is that basically deformations which is occurring perpendicular to the applied load. Okay, if the load is act in the axial direction and the deformation is occurring perpendicular to, to the loading direction, okay, in this direction. In that case we used to call that is buckling problem. Okay, for example, buckling problem. If we apply the load, okay, due to the loading, the structures will go large deformations. Okay, once you remove the load, that structure will not be come to that original position. Okay, this type of basically equilibrium conditions is called that unstable equilibrium. In that case, that's that can visualize like this. This is one uh, shape. Okay, you shape like things, and you have one ball, and you to release the ball, the ball will go somewhere here, and basically it will go in this direction. Okay. In that case, that structure will not be able to come to that again, uh, that equilibrium positions. Okay, okay. In that case, that is called is basically we are saying the unstable equilibrium. Okay, now we have the neutral equilibrium, neutral equilibrium that is basically saying that. If the load is such that structures is basically subject to deformations, and in that deformation stage, it is basically attaining that uh, equilibrium condition. Then you used to call the neutral equilibrium. Okay. For example, a uh, structural member made of steel. In that case, if there is some permanent deformations is occurring, in that permanent deformation, which is the plastic deformation is occurring, in that case, the structures is basically one new set of configurations. That equilibrium is saying that uh, neutral equilibrium. Okay, that can be visualized like this. This one play, uh, one line. Okay, one surface and one ball is there, and we are applying load. Once you apply the load, this ball will come to here, and will attain the equilibrium here somewhere here. That type of equilibrium we are calling as a equilibrium. That means that is attaining one new set of equilibrium conditions. Okay. So I hope uh, idea is clear now. That what are that uh, defined kind of equilibrium condition is that one is that a stable equilibrium okay, where structure can attain the original position once you remove the load unstable equilibrium in that case that deformation needs to be very large in that case structures will not be able to come to the original position in that case that type of equilibrium conditions we used to call that unstable equilibrium okay there will be large deformations another is the neutral equilibrium where structures is subjected to Plastic deformation or permanent deformations, and structure is attaining that equilibrium conditions. 
that type of equilibrium is called that neutral equilibrium okay i hope you got some idea thank you